Party girl. <laughs> Peter's putting away. Hello. Peter's putting away the shopping. Where's your view? It's hot. It says 41.3 Celsius. So, it's hot. What's your color? I don't know what it is in Portuguese yet. <laughs> So all is well with me. Yeah, I'm good. Thanks for asking. <laughs> how are you guys? How are you, how are you Petra? Yeah. It's as good as it gets. Yeah. She's as good as it gets. Wow. Uh, so what have we been, been up to? What have we been up to? Let's ask Petra. Uh -huh. Come closer. I'm busy. busy. Well. <laughs> What have we been up to? Well, we have been uh, painting the van, uh, fixing up little stuff and things, uh, yeah, and because you need more coats of paint on your van, it takes a bit longer, and sometimes it's too just too hot to do anything. So you have to wait for a bit cooler day, but we're working on it. One side and the back and a part of the other side is finished, sort of. At least it has a coat of, coat of paint. And yeah, <laughs> and that's what we've been doing. We're still fixing a, a dent. You want to show them the dent? Or? I didn't wear. Oh, that didn't. <laughs> that didn't. That bit didn't. Oh, <laughs> I can show you. Yes, it's uh, rather large. Yes. Oh, let's uh, show you the bit didn't. Don't know what the previous owner did, but it was humongous. We've already filled it with some uh, fiberglass paste. And yeah, as you can see, it needs a bit more. It's already pasted by the previous owner, I think. So yeah, once that is uh, yeah pasted on and smoothed smoothed out, yeah, it should look uh, pretty good underneath a layer of paint. And we also have the one here, at the back, and as you can see, the back is done, side is done, <laughs> front is done, and this side to there. Is done. So, yeah, we're still not ready yet. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what we have been up to. It's, uh, yeah, it's nice doing it. And, uh, uh, we hope we finish before the... Yeah, when we leave. <laughs> yeah, we're not leaving before we finish. <laughs> still a Portugal, Algarve. There's uh, still some motorhomes about. Just peek outside. <laughs> still some motorhomes about. Um, yeah, it's uh, life is good here, Portugal. Mm -hmm. At some point, we'll either have to make the choice: do we go back to the Netherlands, get MOT done, 
I tried to get another two years out of the van. That's why we've been painting it. Yeah. Until we go to one of the places in Spain that you can do an MOT. But it goes a bit differently, Spanish MOT, because you have to be yourself inside the vehicle and they'll say hit the brakes, uh, turn on the lights, stuff like that. So if you don't speak Spanish, uh, it can be a bit confusing. Mm -hmm. It can get a bit, can get a bit cross with you. Yeah. Um, we know some people who've done it, mm -hmm. but what we don't know is if the Spanish MOT, which is recognized by the Netherlands, if they know that this van, when it gets approved, it gets two years of improvement mm -hmm. instead of one. And I've been looking on the Spanish websites and it, Spanish vehicles have to be approved every six months yeah. of this age. Like our van is from 89, Renault Master. Yeah. So does it mean we, we get an MOT for six months? Does it mean we get an MOT for a year? Or do they automatically know that it gets two years MOT? So there's a lot of uncertainties. Yeah. And I've been looking far and wide, high and low, but I haven't found an answer yet. So you have to make an appointment for a Spanish MOT. There's f there used to be six stations across of Spain, most near the coast where the most Dutch tourists are. Uh, two of those places near the popular, most popular places shut down recently. I think it was Benidorm and Alicante shut down. And there's still a place in Seville, which is closest to here for us, where you can go. And friends of ours uh, just went there. Um, we met another Dutch guy. He says just go to Seville, or it's sort of near Seville, and you can do it there. Um, but I'm not sure if they close down the popular places. They might close this place down. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. There's a lot of uncertainties. Um, we don't want to end up with an MOT for six months, don't want to end no. up with an MOT for a year. <laughs> and I don't want to, because we don't speak Spanish, no, um, no. you don't want any mis miscommunications no. with the Spanish testers. No. I don't know, I've been looking on Google, I've been trying to f talk to other people who've done it. They all give little information on how it's actually done. No. We will probably go back to the Netherlands and have the MOT done there because it's easier and if they tell you something, if it's right or wrong, at least you understand what they're saying. And if, I don't know if they speak English at this, those stations, I don't know if there's a Dutch speaking person, I've been not been able to find any info on it. And because it's a bit vague, I don't know what to expect and I don't like sort of going in blind. And I would like to have answer to those questions. Yeah, there's a lot of reasons why it wouldn't be a good idea to do the Spanish MOT. Mm -hmm. uh, but if, you, if you're watching this and you have done one, maybe you have to answer to the questions that I just asked. Mm -hmm. And let us know in the comments. Patrick is uh, standing down a bit. And uh, I'm preparing dinner. Pizza. <laughs> Let's have a look, see. How far is it? Oh, no. I got my head <laughs> not supposed to film me working. People think I'm lazy. People might talk. You gotta keep up to your parents. <laughs> remember the time he, that you were supervising. Yeah, it's a long time ago, but we learned a lot since then. Yeah, we did. Rubbing down, mm -hmm. feeling for any potholes. Uh, yep. Mm -hmm. And this is a uh, fiberglass filler mm -hmm. over here. Yep. That you showed yesterday. Yep, I did. And uh, hopefully this can stay in. I have to fill this a bit more. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this needs a bit more filler on top of here. Yep. And then we sand this down as well. Yep. We brought the lines a little bit mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and because probably it's uh, uh, some sort of maybe it hit a pole or something. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, getting there. Oh. But uh, yeah, 
it's now shade, eh? so yeah. it's a good time to do, to the do stuff. The best time to do this, yeah. Okay, wrap down the corner a bit as well. Let's show you. The corner bit. Mm -hmm. Doing this as well. Yeah. So making it ready to paint. This is filler in it. Let's get this wood. I know, right? Did you do that? Moses baby's bottom. So yeah, that's what we've been up to. Yep. So, I'll get back to dinner. Awesome. Mm -hmm.